If you want to make at least $5,000 monthly trading stocks, I have just the solution for you. You don't need to sit before your computer the whole day, and you don't need to trade lots and lots of stocks every day. In fact, you need to trade a maximum of seven to eight times per month to reach your $5,000 profit target, and you may trade only one stock. If this sounds good enough to you, stick around. In this video, I will give you the strategy and the stocks that work well with that strategy. In addition, I will show you how to set up a notification system so that you know exactly when to enter or exit the market. Many traders use moving averages to understand the market trend. Some traders use even five moving averages on their chart to find a suitable entry and exit point. But trading is not about what you see on the chart. It is about how you interpret it. It is about guts and determination, coupled with behaving as a responsible human being. You don't have to be fast to be a profitable trader, but you must understand your trade before executing it. We need three basic things to earn $5,000 monthly apart from the required capital. We need a platform, a chart, and an indicator. We will use the TradingView web platform for this tutorial. Open a free account by going to tradingview.com if you have not done that already. This is what your chart will look like. By default, you will see Apple stock on the chart. We are going to use Mara as our underlying stock. Click Apple at the top left corner and type M-A-R-A -A and select Marathon Digital Holdings from the list. Now we are going to change the chart a little bit. From the drop-down menu, we will choose an hourly time frame. You need a longer time frame to avoid the market noise. Now we will change the candle style to Heiken Ashi. Heiken Ashi is on the list that opens up once you click the candles tab on the top bar. The chart is ready. Now we need accurate buy-sell signals to execute trades. Go to the indicators tab and type UT bot. Select the one created by Yo Adrian. Go to the indicators settings and change the input to the following. Key value 2, ATR, period 12. Now we have some excellent buy and sell signals on the chart. For long trades, wait for the first green candle after the buy signal is finished. Buy the stock at the beginning of the second green candle with a stop loss right at the green ATR line. You can set up a trailing stop loss so that you don't need to attend your computer. The stop loss will update itself as and when needed. You even don't need to manually exit a trade because the stop loss or trailing stop will become a market order when the stock price hits them. For short trades, wait for the sell signal and then wait for the first red candle to be finished. Sell the stock at the beginning of the second red candle with a stop loss at the red ATR line above the candle. When a trade ends, it creates an immediate opportunity for a reverse trade. If you are in a long trade, you may go short now and vice versa. Don't take the trade if the first candle is too long. It means your stop loss will be high. Wait for the market to come closer to the ATR line before entering the market. You don't need to sit before your platform waiting for a signal to appear. You can set up a notification by clicking the alert tab that is beside the indicators tab. From the settings, choose Mara, then crossing, and then UT bot 2 and 12 as condition. Trailing stop will automatically be selected. Choose an expiration date for the alert and give the alert a name. For example, Trade Mara. Now click the notification tab and choose the first checkbox, Notify in app. Choose Send Email and then Play Sound. Now click Create and you are done. For a free plan, you can create only one notification at a time. That is fine for us as we will make only one trade at a time. Now, I will give you a few stocks that respect the ATR line. I understand that you may not have a lot of capital to trade with, so this list will have stocks under $30 but don't underestimate them.
simply because they are not mega caps. They have excellent volatility that you can exploit for your profit. You will still make at least $5,000 per month by selecting any of these stocks to trade. They are Mara, Riot, Unity Software, Snap Technologies, Affirm, Upstart, and Palantir. If you have a bigger account, trade SOXL, TQQQ, DPST, and UPRO. These are leverage products and are highly volatile, but it is highly profitable to trade them. I mostly trade SOXL or Direction Daily Semiconductor Bull 3X. You can also trade Block, Twilio, Roku, and Shopify. If you have more capital than that, trade Coinbase, AMD, Moderna, NVIDIA, Snowflake, Tesla, Spotify, and CrowdStrike. I recommend that you trade at least 1,000 shares at a time so that your return is high enough. 1,000 shares of SoFi will cost you a little over $7,000. If you have a margin account, you may well be able to trade 1,000 SoFi with only $3,000 of your own money. If you are new to trading and do not know how to trade in a margin account, watch this video. In it, I explain the ins and outs of margin trading. It will be a good introduction for you. I should mention that you will not win every trade by following this strategy. You will lose many trades, but your losers will be small and winners big. You will be a profitable trader if you win only three trades out of ten, provided you maximize your winners. Many traders cannot wait to exit a trade when they are in profit. Thus, they lose the opportunity to earn more. Based on the market, you will hold a trade for hours or days. Your risk versus reward ratio may be as high as 1 to 10 or even higher. Don't jump from stock to stock because you have lost a trade. A rising stock can rise more and a falling stock can fall more. At the same time, both can reverse the trend and create new trends and new trading opportunities. Stick to the strategy. Money will come. This is VWO, Vanguard FTSE Emerging Markets ETF, something I like to trade. You would have made four trades so far in July, too long and too short. The third trade would have been a loser for you. But the three other trades would have made you well above $5,000, provided you traded at least 1,000 shares each time. Thank you for watching this far. If this video was of any help to you, please like this video. That helps the YouTube algorithm. Also subscribe to my channel for more videos on money, trading, and investing. It is a new channel and every subscription is important to me. Goodbye, and I will see you in the next video.